What's up guys, today's we'll take a look at top 5 best car dash cam 2022, that are available on the market, I made this list based on my personal research, if you would like more information about these products and their latest prices, check out the description below. Don't forget to subscribe for more reviews, ok, let's get started with the video. Number 5 if you prefer a dash cam that people aren't likely to notice, we recommend the Garmin Dash Cam Mini 2, which is one of the smallest and most discreet models we've tested. About the size of a key fob, the Mini 2 virtually disappears on the windshield. Still, it provides surprisingly good video quality for a 1080p single camera model, and its windshield mount is one of the best we've seen, it sticks firmly to the windshield with adhesive. But magnets allow you to easily remove everything but a small plastic circle when you want to throw the camera in the glove box or move it to another vehicle. It has many of the same features you get with the bigger, and, in most cases, pricier, models, including night vision, 24-hour parked car monitoring, built-in Wi-Fi, and voice control. Because the Mini 2 has only two physical buttons and no display, though, you have to use Garmin's smartphone app to view video, to adjust settings and even to aim the camera properly. Number 4 The Nextbase 622GW is perhaps the best looking dash cam on this list, with more image stabilization than its 422GW and 522GW predecessors. This 4K camera maximizes capture quality with a rotating polarizer on the front of the lens, image stabilization and built-in processing to reduce the occlusion of fog in recordings. Your choice of three rear camera modules is available to also record the cabin or rear window view. Two of those three rear cam options plug elegantly into the 622GW's main body, while the third is mounted remotely on a long cable for the best rear road view. Alexa is built in for voice control of the device, and in the event of a detected major collision the 622GW can upload your blood type, allergies and other relevant medical history to an emergency call center if you opted in during setup. The 622GW also features support for what three words, an alternate GPS labeling platform that is slick but few people seem to use. Control of the 622GW is via its rear screen or phone app. It's one of the larger cams out there, partly due to its prominent lens, but its quality of finish and performance would help make it a welcome addition on your windshield. Number 3 the Nexar Beam Dash Cam is also just an HD camera but integrates GPS location data into its recordings via a GPS receiver built into its windshield mount. It uses image processing algorithms to alert you to road hazards and can let others know if you're delayed getting to your destination via the dedicated Nexar app. Check whether your phone is supported before buying a Beam. A number of popular phones are not as of this writing, which reduces the number of advanced features the Beam can offer. This dash cam is a rear-facing camera that records crisp 135-degree wide dash cam footage in 1080p and includes a 32GB SD card. Like the Garmin Mini 2, the Beam uses your connected phone for its full interface, but also uses the pairing to do free unlimited clip backups. Next to the Garmin Mini 2, it's the least obtrusive option on the list, though it's still much larger than the Mini 2. Number 2 Another of the 4K front slash 1080p rear camera setups, the Viafo A129 Pro Duo was the first to win us over to the benefits of 4K. It's been matched in those abilities by newer models, but the A129 comes at a competitive price that can't be ignored. Plus it offers integrated GPS and a pleasant user experience. Number 1 the Vantru N4 is a three-channel powerhouse able to record out the windshield, inside and behind the car all at once in HD or greater resolution, or it can record two views at once in 4K and HD. Two of the views are captured by sensors built into the main front-facing unit, while the third is recorded by a remote rear camera that comes with a long cable to reach the back window on most vehicles. Unlike many dash cams today, the N4 doesn't require a phone for settings or clip review, it has a compact but sharp rear screen and plenty of dedicated buttons for features and settings. This is a great camera if you don't want to have to fuss with the second device. 
The N4 also has motion detection, not just impact detection, so it can wake up and record activity around the car when it's parked. It also uses a robust supercapacitor to power those functions when the car is off, as opposed to a conventional battery that may suffer in a car's punishing temperatures. Thank you for watching guys, I hope you like this video. If this video is helpful to you, please don't forget to like comments, and be sure to subscribe to get more reviews. Hope to see you guys in the next video.